2024 has been a year like no other, especially for those fascinated by the unknown. UFO sightings have skyrocketed, and strange encounters are becoming so frequent that it feels like something big is about to happen. Could we be on the verge of a historic moment? Contact with extraterrestrial life? The question isn't just if they'll reach out, but how they'll approach us. Will they bring peace, offering advanced technology that could transform our world? Or have they been silently monitoring us, studying our strengths and weaknesses, waiting for the right moment to reveal their intentions, good or bad? While the world holds its breath, let's take a look at the most unforgettable UFO sightings of 2024. These strange events aren't just random lights in the sky. They're incidents that challenge what we know and open the door to possibilities that could reshape our understanding of life beyond Earth. In one case, a sighting took place right in the heart of the Russia-Ukraine conflict, raising questions about whether these visitors from the stars are observing how we conduct warfare. Are they passive spectators? Or could they be preparing for something more? Join us as we count down the top 10 alien encounters of 2024, each one more bizarre than the last. Buckle up because these stories just might change the way you see the world forever. Number one, 10 foot humanoids on a Brazilian mountain. So for people who keep saying that UFOs and aliens are only seen in the US, here is something specially for you. Just one week after the Miami shadow alien encounter in January, 2024, people in Brazil encountered two weird alien creatures on top of a hill at an island, three kilometers off the coast of Southeast Brazil. Local hikers who recorded the footage reported that two alien creatures were spotted on the mountain and they were supposedly 10 feet tall, similar to the Miami shadow alien. The reason they say they are so tall is because the shrubbery on that hill was barely reaching their knees, which would ideally cover half of a normal human. The aliens were then seen walking down the hill quicker than normal humans with bigger strides, obviously because of their tall stature. Even Brazil's provincial government commented on the video calling the creatures strange beings. Were these the same aliens who were seen in Miami on New Year's and have now moved to South America? Number two, UFO reported over New York's LaGuardia Airport. This is the latest sighting in the list. This shocking sighting took place just recently in March 2024. Michelle Reyes was on a commercial flight above New York's LaGuardia Airport on 25th of March. She was casually recording a video of New York's skyline like most travelers do as their plane gets ready to land. When suddenly, she spotted something very unusual. She saw a mysterious, eerie-looking black disc-like object zooming past her plane from right to left. The dark object was traveling at roughly 2,500 feet above ground level and was relatively close to the plane. The motion was really quick, but if we pause the footage, you can clearly see that this UAP was neither a drone nor any manned aircraft that we know of. Now let's see the footage in real time. Even if we consider the fact that the plane and the UFO are moving in opposite directions, it still seemed like the UFO was moving at tremendous speeds like a fighter jet. No man-made drone yet can achieve max speed while flying. After recording the footage, Michelle Reyes immediately emailed the Federal Aviation Administration to let them know what she saw. But even the FAA are still clueless as to what the mysterious black disc was. And this is also not the first time that a UFO was seen flying near an airport. Number three, UFO in Spain vanishes in seconds. This particular sighting got a lot of social media attention, mainly as it took place near the party capital of the world, Ibiza. Tourists were enjoying the calm ocean atop a cliff in the evening at the Esvedra Island near Ibiza. Surprisingly, a half crescent moon was also visible during that time of the day and a tourist who was trying to capture that half-crescent moon noticed something very unusual near it in the sky. She noticed a white bright orb stationary near the moon. Upon spotting it, she immediately pointed it out to her friend, and they both ran closer to get a better view of the unusual object. But after they zoomed in on the orb to record some clear footage, something very eerie happened. The orb shockingly zoomed to the right with unprecedented speed and was never seen again. The speed with which it zipped out of the field of vision of the camera was totally otherworldly. Such an impossible feat cannot be achieved by any man-made craft that we know of. 
even the most powerful rocket ever built. SpaceX's Starship, which has a top speed of 16,000 miles per hour, would find it extremely difficult to achieve such quick momentum in just a split second. Also the fact that the bright orb was stationary all that while, but zoomed away the moment the tourist tried to capture it on camera goes to show that the aliens knew that they were being monitored. But how advanced is their tech that they can sense someone trying to record them from so far away? Number 4. UFO seen in Lancaster and Palmdale, California. This sighting is the most recent one and took place on the 16th of August. It also got a lot of social media attention as it took place in California. These eerie sightings took place between the cities of Palmdale and Lancaster, north of Los Angeles and close to a U.S. Air Force base, which is why a lot of people are pointing out that this might be the U.S. military testing out its advanced crafts. Residents of Lancaster and Palmdale reported seeing up to six UFOs in the skies late Friday night. Some even saw the UFOs abruptly stopping midair and going in a different direction. Initially, they thought that they were shooting stars, but then suddenly, these UFOs started moving in a zigzag fashion, suggesting it was a craft being controlled by someone. At first, the UFO appears to be completely stationary, emanating lights which pretty much resemble those coming from top of a police car. Then, shockingly, the UFO began to descend, which startled everyone. There were even reports that one of these UFOs landed further out in California on a beach, and the authorities obviously cordoned off the area for further investigation. But surprisingly, nothing was announced in the news regarding these UFO sightings. Is the US government and law enforcement trying to conceal something from the general public? Did these UFOs descend on their own, or were they shot down by the US military? Also, Palmdale is no stranger to UFO activity, as back in 2022, residents of this city experienced something otherworldly that made them fear for their very lives. People spotted more than a hundred so-called lights in the night sky, and some of these even moved, so they were definitely not stars. But what exactly were they? Were they smaller UFOs coming out of a mothership? And why were so many UFOs hovering over Palmdale that night? Number 5. Metallic Sphere Seen at U.S. Navy Air Show This unusual sighting took place in May 2224, just two months after the LaGuardia Airport Black Disc Incident. On the bright morning of 28th of May, a Navy air show was on in full swing in Long Island with more than eager spectators. The Blue Angels, who are a U.S. Navy flight demonstration squadron, were also performing at the air show that day. And as always, people were filming the crazy fighter jet maneuvers when one of the spectators noticed something really inexplicable. In the video recorded by this particular witness, we can clearly see the Super Hornet jet moving from right to left, but if you slow down the video, you will notice a shiny metallic sphere rush past the U.S. Navy jet. The incident takes place so quickly that had it not been for the vigilant spectator, someone would think it's just a fly passing in front of the camera. Metallic spheres of this kind have been encountered in the past by not just U.S. Navy pilots, but Colombian commercial pilots. And even U.S. military personnel in the Middle East. So if this UFO was only visible on slowing down the footage, what max speed was it traveling at without any visible means of propulsion known to man? And what creates even more curiosity is that these metallic spheres are normally seen near military installations. So are these aliens keeping a watchful eye on our military technology? Are they doing so to gauge if we are a threat to them before they make some kind of contact with us? Number six, green UFO seen in Tehran. This sighting took place somewhere in May in Tehran, a city in Iran. And many would say that this is just plain CGI, but to be really honest, this sighting has not been debunked yet. This seems like the closest UFO sighting ever. Second only to the metallic sphere that zoomed right past a commercial plane in Colombia in 2023. What seems really crazy is that this UFO emanating bright green light 
hovered right over the city, just a few hundred meters above ground level. Such up close and clear footage of a UFO has never been captured on camera. The nearness of the craft can clearly be gauged by the size of the visible UFO, which seems as big as a commercial airplane. And this same green UFO was seen by many others in the city, but this time at a higher altitude, moving with the same laid back speed. Why was this specific UFO hovering so slow as compared to all the other UFOs that just speed off when they realize that they have been spotted, like the UFO seen in Ibiza, Spain? Or was this some highly advanced military aircraft that the Iranian armed forces were just testing? Number seven, UFO seen by couple in Canada. In the last few decades, Canada has also become a hotspot for UFO sightings. The most recent one occurred on 14th May in the Fort Alexander area. A Canadian couple stumbled upon an extraordinary sight when they noticed four UFOs shining as brightly as the sun over a nearby river. Justin Stevenson and his wife were driving through Fort Alexander around 10 p.m. when they spotted several mysterious orbs emitting yellow lights hovering over the Winnipeg River. Justin immediately started recording this baffling sighting which left him and his wife totally dumbstruck. To the normal eye, it appears like there are four suns on the horizon. Such a UFO emitting an orangish yellow light has been seen once over Texas as well. Are these orange UFOs all part of the same battalion keeping a watch over the continent of North America? Also after his wife posted the footage on Facebook, many were quick to point out that it might just be a strange anomaly. Was this just a freak natural incident or multiple UFOs indeed? We will only know with time. Number eight, UFOs seen in Nagpur, India. This next sighting comes all the way from India. Back in June, people in the city of Nagpur were shocked to see such an unnatural phenomena occur in the night sky. June is mostly monsoon season in India, so the skies are heavily clouded with thick rain-bearing clouds. But the UFOs were so bright that their lights penetrated through the dark clouds, making them clearly visible to people below. In this footage, we can see what seems to be multiple UFOs moving quickly in a circular fashion. Generally, UFOs are known to either zip away like the Colombian UFO seen in 2023, or just stay stationary and disappear. Like in the case of the Texas and Area 51 sightings. But this might be the first time that UFOs have been seen going round and round at such high speeds. Were they trying to create a whirlpool of sorts to open some kind of portal? Number nine. UFO seen by Ukrainian soldiers during the Russia-Ukraine war. Russian President Vladimir Putin recently said that he would use nuclear weapons if NATO deployed their troops on ground to fight against Russia alongside Ukraine. And it was after this horrendous nuclear threat by Putin that a mysteriously eerie looking UFO was seen by Ukrainian soldiers. This is the second time that a UFO has been spotted in a war zone. Normally, UFOs have been seen above cities and also over mountains, but rarely have UFOs been spotted during an active war by soldiers. The footage shows Ukrainian soldiers from the 406th Battalion totally speechless and horrified after seeing the UFO right in front of them. You can't blame them for such a reaction as for a minute, they actually thought that it was a new Russian aircraft that was ready to attack them with a nuclear weapon but this UFO was disc-shaped and was completely stationary, floating in air for the entire duration. This completely bamboozled the Ukrainian soldiers who can be heard swearing in Russian out of fear of not being able to comprehend what they had just witnessed. The scary footage was captured by a heat vision quadcopter drone used by the Ukrainian armed forces. This mysterious hovering object bears a striking resemblance to the Baghdad Phantom. A skinny, cylindrical object spotted above Iraq in May 2022 by the infrared heat camera of a U.S. Air Force Reaper drone. And this was not the last time that trained military personnel came across alien spaceships.
Number 10, 10 foot alien seen outside a mall in Miami. For some odd reason, a lot of UFO and alien sightings always happen in the United States of America. Some would say it's the land of Hollywood, and that's where all this science fiction originates. Many outside the US believe that most UFO and alien videos captured on camera are just hoaxes made by people to get viral attention. But what happened at Miami on 1st January caught the attention of not just the local people, but also the city police and to be precise, hordes of them. It all started when a brawl broke out among some 50-odd teenagers who were using sticks and fireworks to battle each other. Miami police were immediately called in to get the situation under control. In response, more than two dozen police cars stormed the area to take charge of the situation. But people believe that cops were there to access another supposedly bigger threat. There are claims that an eight to 10 foot shadowy alien creature was seen outside the mall. And that was the real reason why the cops arrived at the crime scene. When contacted later, Miami police confirmed in an official statement that there was no such shadowy alien. Contrary to this, one eyewitness who was spending New Year's at the mall actually said to have seen a tall shadowy creature chasing him, then disappearing and reappearing again. I look back, it looked like, like, like a big ass shadow, but it was solid at the same time, like a few, like a few shadows, but they were solid at the same time. And it, was, it almost looked like they was coming our direction, like they was chasing us, but they was disappearing and reappearing closer. All this while police were firing gunshots at the same creature. And this was also not the last time a 10-foot alien creature appeared out of nowhere. As just a couple of weeks later, 11-foot aliens were seen on top of a mountain in Brazil. 2024 has not even ended, and we have already had 10 hard-hitting sightings. Why is the frequency of these sightings on the rise? Are they ready to finally reveal themselves to us? And if yes, what can we expect out of this meeting? Peace in exchange of advanced technology or just total annihilation?